Imagine a universe where everything that has ever happened and everything that will ever happen is happening right now. There is no past, no present, no future, just one eternal, unchanging now. It sounds like science fiction, but what if this is the universe we live in? What if time, as we understand it, doesn't exist? This is not just a thought experiment. Physicists like Michio Kaku suggest that time might be an illusion. And now, thanks to the groundbreaking observations of the James Webb Space Telescope, we are beginning to see the universe in a whole new light, a light that challenges our most fundamental assumptions about reality itself. The James Webb Space Telescope is the most powerful telescope ever built. This marvel of engineering and science represents humanity's quest to understand the cosmos. It is a testament to our desire to explore the unknown and push the boundaries of what we know about the universe. Stationed a million miles from Earth, it can see farther into space and therefore further back in time than any instrument before it. This distance allows it to avoid the interference of Earth's atmosphere, providing a clearer and more detailed view of the cosmos. The telescope's position at the second Lagrange point, a gravitationally stable spot, ensures it can maintain its orientation with minimal fuel consumption. With its infrared vision, it can pierce through clouds of gas and dust, revealing the universe's first stars and galaxies, objects so distant that their light has taken billions of years to reach us. This capability is crucial because many of the universe's earliest objects are shrouded in cosmic dust, making them invisible to optical telescopes. The Webb telescope's ability to see in the infrared spectrum allows it to uncover these hidden treasures. But the Webb Telescope is not just showing us what the universe looked like billions of years ago, it is also providing insights into the formation and evolution of galaxies, stars, and planetary systems. By studying these ancient objects, scientists can learn more about the processes that shaped the universe and led to the creation of our own solar system. It's showing us that the universe, at its most fundamental level, might not work the way we think it does. The data collected by the Webb Telescope is challenging existing theories and prompting scientists to rethink their understanding of the cosmos. This new information could lead to groundbreaking discoveries and a deeper comprehension of the fundamental laws that govern the universe. The images and data beamed back from this incredible machine are forcing us to confront the possibility that time itself is not what it seems. As we delve deeper into the mysteries of the universe, the James Webb Space Telescope stands as a beacon of human curiosity and ingenuity, guiding us toward a future where the secrets of the cosmos are within our grasp. We experience time as a linear progression, a steady march from the past, through the present, and into the future. But what if this perception is just that, a perception shaped by our limited human experience? What if, as Albert Einstein theorized over a century ago, time is not absolute but relative? Einstein's theory of relativity tells us that time is not a constant. It can be stretched and compressed by gravity and motion. The faster you move, the slower time passes for you relative to someone standing still. This means that time is not a universal metronome ticking at the same rate for everyone everywhere. It's more like a river flowing at different speeds in different places. The James Webb Space Telescope's observations of the early universe are providing some of the most compelling evidence yet for Einstein's theories. By studying the light from distant galaxies, astronomers can measure how fast the universe was expanding in the past, and what they're finding is that the early universe was expanding much faster than our current understanding of physics can explain. This discovery has profound implications. It suggests that our understanding of gravity, the force that shapes the universe, is incomplete, and it raises the possibility that the early universe, the period just after the Big Bang, might have operated under very different laws of physics than the universe we observe today. Could it be that in this early universe time itself behaved differently? If time is not absolute, if it can be stretched and compressed, then the idea of a fixed past, present, and future starts to break down. This leads us to a mind-bending concept known as the Block Universe Theory. The Block Universe Theory proposes that the past, present, and future all exist simultaneously. Imagine a loaf of bread where each slice represents a moment in time. The entire loaf, all the slices together, is the block universe. Every moment in time, from the Big Bang to the end of the universe, already exists, just like all the slices of bread already exist within the loaf. In the block universe, there is no flow of time. There is no special moment called now. Just as every point in space exists, every point in time exists as well. 
Our perception of time passing of moving from the past to the future is just that. A perception and artifact of how our brains process information. This has profound implications for our understanding of free will. If the future is already written, already exists within the block universe, then are we truly in control of our choices? Or are our lives, our decisions, our entire destinies already predetermined? The block universe theory, while mind-boggling, is just one of the ways physicists are trying to make sense of the universe revealed by the James Webb Space Telescope. This theory suggests that time is like a block where past, present, and future all coexist simultaneously. It challenges our everyday experience of time flowing like a river, making us question the very nature of reality itself. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its unprecedented ability to peer into the distant past of the universe, provides us with data that could either support or refute such theories, pushing the boundaries of our understanding. Another, even more radical idea, is the participatory universe concept. This idea takes the notion of observation to a whole new level, suggesting that the universe requires observers to bring it into existence. The participatory universe, a term coined by physicist John Wheeler, suggests that the universe is not a passive observer, but an active participant in its own creation. Wheeler's idea is that the act of observation is not just a passive receipt of information, but an active process that shapes the very fabric of reality. It proposes that reality, including time itself, is not something objective and external to us, but is brought into being by the act of observation. This means that the universe is, in a sense, incomplete without conscious beings to observe it. In this view, consciousness is not just a byproduct of the universe but a fundamental aspect of it. This radical idea suggests that our minds are not separate from the cosmos but are deeply intertwined with it. We are not just observers of the universe, we are, in a very real sense, participants in its unfolding story. Our very act of observing the universe contributes to its ongoing creation, making us co-creators of reality itself. This perspective not only changes how we see the universe, but also how we see ourselves within it. The James Webb Space Telescope is more than just a telescope. It's a time machine, a marvel of modern engineering that allows us to peer back billions of years into the past. It serves as a window into the universe's distant past, revealing the secrets of galaxies, stars, and nebulae that have long since faded from view. But it's also a mirror reflecting back at us our own profound ignorance about the nature of reality itself. Each discovery it makes forces us to reconsider what we thought we knew. The discoveries it's making are challenging our most fundamental assumptions about time, space, and the nature of existence. We are beginning to understand that the universe is not a static entity, but a dynamic, ever-changing tapestry. As we continue to explore the cosmos, we must be prepared to confront the possibility that the universe is far stranger and more wonderful than we ever imagined. The more we learn, the more we realize how much we have yet to discover. We may find that time is not what we thought it was, that it flows differently in different parts of the universe, or that it might even be an illusion created by our limited perception. That reality is not fixed but fluid, constantly shifting and changing in ways that we are only beginning to understand. The boundaries between what is real and what is imagined may be far more porous than we ever thought, and that we ourselves play a far more active role in shaping the universe than we ever dared to dream. Our thoughts, our observations, and our actions may influence the very fabric of reality, intertwining our existence with the cosmos in ways that are both profound and mysterious.